Hey guys, this is Sam. Today we are going to learn how to create a CSS preloader. This is the continuation of the last video. Last video also I talk about how to uh, create a circular CSS preloader. So in this lesson I am going to talk about how to create a dotted, dotted uh, CSS preloader. So let's begin by creating a new file. So this is the fourth lesson dotted CSS preloader and don't forget to put HTML dot HTML yeah and my HTML snippet yeah so let's create a container for the preloader and inside this div i'm going to have three spans done so let's add a style so display in like display in line block and i just don't want to have any uh, styles here so let's concentrate on the span elements okay so width is 10 pixel and height is 10 pixel and i just want to have the background color of black okay let's see this file in browser yeah you're not seeing anything okay now let's see what went wrong here The span is there. Okay. Okay. Since <laughs> see what we are using is span. So span is an inline element. So you just put display in line block. So now it will block. That's it. So and one more thing, I don't want uh, to have a square here. So I just set border radius to and the percentage so it will look like a circle perfect circle yeah now add an animation now add an animation to this my animation is let's have this name preloader and the duration for this animation is one second and i just i just don't want to have any speed curve I just go I just want to go with a linear and the iteration count should be infinite so I'm sorry so keyframes preloader again I'm telling don't confuse this class preloader and this animation preloader okay both are different I'm going to use transform property here so scale zero and scale one. Let's see this in action. Okay. It's ugly anyway, let's see. And I'm going to add one more property here. Let's see what it does, alternate and test it out actually this alternate defines whether an animation should play in reverse direction like in uh, alternative cycles okay so i am done with this but i just want to have this animation first and second and third so i just want to have the delay between these three uh, span elements okay so preloader span and the child we learned this from the last lesson so i'm adding the style for the first lesson uh, first uh, element animation delay 0 0.2 seconds and i'm copying this paste here paste it here so to the second element to the third element to the second element i'm going to have 0.5 and 0.8 just save it just test it out 
actually this animation is looking good but look at the starting point you don't see any animation right it's because of the animation delay we are using here so this is the positive animation delay so what i'm going to do is i'm going to use negative value so it will start from the off way so let's have this as a minus 0 0.5 so minus 0 0.2 yes let's check it out wow let's just look at the smoothness okay guys this is how you can create dotted animation uh, dotted css split roller if you want to learn more stuff like this please subscribe to my channel and uh, share with your friends if you want to have this source code you please check the description area thank you bye bye